Welcome to JSA TV Live, the newsroom for data center and telecom professionals. I'm Barb Mitchell coming to you today live from the floor of Data Cloud Global Congress here in beautiful Monaco. And thanks for joining me, gentlemen. Today I have Steve Dean, SVP and GM of Utilities for Wesco, and Alan Faramon, VP of Sales for um, APAC and EMEA for Wesco. Great. Thanks for having yeah. us today. We yeah, really thanks. appreciate it. Thanks for joining us. And we've been seeing you around a little bit at the show. And uh, what are your thoughts so far? The show has been absolutely incredible for us. We've had several meetings. We had a chance to walk the show, obviously. But then the meetings that we've had with customers have really been incredible. Yeah. Yeah. And just to add to that, we've uh, we've got lots of partners here uh, that we work with all over the world. And, mm -hmm. uh, you know, building those relationships and keeping those relationships sustainable. Fantastic. Yeah. And we had a chance to see each other at, at dinner the other night. You were right. Westco. Uh, we're proud sponsors of the a iMason's advisory dinner. First of all, what a beautiful venue that uh, was, wasn't it? Unbelievable. Yeah, I, I could, yeah it was stunning. Uh, and, and it was a, a beautiful evening, but also great to celebrate the work that iMason's is doing. And I know, uh, you know, you're aligned, you know, to some of their pillars, so specifically around diversity and inclusion. Would you like to speak to that a little bit? Sure, we will. Yeah. So it was really an incredible event. Maricel, who works with us, is one of the founding members on the board. Right. So one of the things that, you know, our alignment on the pillars has been incredibly successful, especially around the, um, the diversity and inclusion. So one of the things at Wesco that we've done recently is we've stood up five business resource groups inside our organization. Right. So we spent a lot of time talking to iMasons about that. And then how do we partner with them and how do we drive that deeper into our organization? Um, you know, at Wesco, we strive to be a very inclusive environment for all of our folks that work for us yeah. globally. Yeah, and just to add to that, outstanding networking event. Uh, mm -hmm. Absolutely fantastic. We've got existing customers there, potential new customers. So it's just outstanding. Yeah. And again, the venue was something. Beautiful. Special. And we got to talk football. Which was good. We talked <laughs> about Wrexham. We, we talked about Wrexham, which was nice. It was good. You know, I'd fit that in somehow. <laughs> Very fun. Uh, yeah, it was a great, great evening. But let's step back for a second and talk sure. about Wesco. Uh, so for our viewers who who may not know all that you do, let's start with the sort of the bigger picture. Sure. Of Wesco. So, so Wesco is a global organization. We have over twenty thousand employees, and we're really broken into three very strategic business units. So the first one is CSS, or Communication and Security Systems. The second is EES, which is Electronic and Electrical. And the third is the division I work in, is Utility and Broadband Solutions. And we basically bring those solutions to our customers globally, uh, and really end-to-end -end solutions. Right. And then, yeah, and, and for specifically for data centers, I know you have a whole division focused on that. Yeah, Wesco have been involved in the data center business for, for many years, mm -hmm. uh, servicing many clients with all sorts of different uh, different solutions. Uh, but we've recently acquired a company called Rahi, uh, which is a great addition to the right. uh, to the portfolio. It adds to our offering, it adds to our solutions. And what we're really trying to do there is bring the passive environment together with the active environment. And that's what Rahi do for us globally. Yeah. Right. So we formed a Wesco Data Center Solutions Group. And one of the things we're focusing on, again, is from power and communications all the way through the entire data center. Right. So I was fortunate enough to join this week to learn a little more about the power side and then that solution we can bring globally. So we're a leading player in North America for utilities. But now we're looking to say, how do we do that globally and support Wesco Data Center Solutions? Yeah, and Wesco Data Center Solutions, it's a partner inclusive model. Uh, so as we go to market and evolve Wesco Data Center Solutions, yeah. it's all around partnership. It's all around bringing that community together so that we can offer a better service to the clients. Fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. So what when we're sort of watching this, uh, you know, this focus on data centers and the and sort of the global beyond North America and beyond uh, Europe, what should we expect to see over the next sort of 12 months? In the industry itself? With Wesco. Oh, with yeah. Wesco. So I think what you're going to see is, is, is a broader solution and end-to-end -end solution. Okay. Yeah. Right? So we're really looking at all the products. So when we, we formed the Wesco Data Center Solutions, we've always had a very good position in the communication side. And now mm -hmm. how do we bring that total solution to include power? Right. Yeah, and that scales globally as well, all, all across the world. So you go into Asia, you all across Europe, all across North America and Latin America. And what we are doing is putting the same footprint everywhere, all across the world. Brilliant. Yeah, yeah. And, and our mode of really, you know, when you think about Wesco, it's how do we power, protect uh, and communicate with all of our customers? 
Love it. Customer focus. Customer focus. Right? Yeah. Very customer centric organization. Yeah. And then bringing that end to end solution. Okay, great. Well, for those of our viewers that are watching this live right now, hello to all of you. <laughs> um, they people may want to find you here or connect with you while in Monaco, but but a lot you know a lot of folks may miss you or may not have had the you know the opportunity to come to this show. Sure. How can they reach you? How can they connect with you to learn more? Well, basically, we're we're all over the world. Um, you can connect with us in any country, in any language. It's pretty easy to do. You know, that's key to us. That's critical to us. Yeah. Um, connect with us online. Connect with us across the web. A any way that uh, you'll always find a, a Wesco person available for to help and support. And we operate in several different countries. And then obviously in LinkedIn, you know, the two of us are always right. available. And we can certainly make that link to the local countries and the local resources. Yeah, perfect. Thank you. All right. Thank you so much. I'm, I'm so glad we had this opportunity to connect with you us too. today. Appreciate the time. Yeah, thank you. And thank you, viewers, for tuning in to JSA TV live here at Data Cloud Global Congress in Monaco. Until next time.